Delta State Governor Sharif Oboruri has announced plans to rebuild the Okwama Community School and Health Center, which was destroyed following the killing of four military officers and 13 soldiers. Oboruri urged those displaced to relocate to the internally displaced persons camp at Ewu, stating that the government would prioritize peace and development and encourage the community to uphold positive ideals. The kids who come here. Show me the, the kids who are present. They have to do their best by having their restraining themselves. You can watch the left hand corner, two major captain and other soldiers. And you see that they see peace. I was commenting one Mr. and Mr. President. Mr. President gave me his promise, two of us gave me his promise. Through the National Security Advisor, Chief of the Staff, we follow all those processes. As we speak, the rifles of the military is still missing. So we need to come up be on the same page. But there's a way we will do it. You got to a stage, government will say, okay, since you don't want this one, let us know. Because people are attacking the process to blackmail the government and federal government. You should not listen to those people, the government. We do not trust people who have gone to TV to speak on your behalf. What else do you want? Where the camp is cited today is the ancestral home of the young people. What are you? This camp is not cited in the local government headquarters. It's still in your kingdom. You want to be very safe. You cannot build a camp, any big camp. And you don't have security. They have to secure the place. So the people do their life will be safe. General of a rule uh, kingdom, a devil, a gedegbe, praised the inclusion of the two ton indigents in the IDP committee to identify those affected by the incident, and also praised the governor's support and asked him to do more. The Okoloba people are wishing that Okwama leave the place so they can occupy the place. He has allayed a fear that that will not happen, that Okwama will be rebuilt. But it's a matter of time. Those are very reassuring words for us. The fears that we have before the Ayaz are laid, he told us too that immediately that the health center will be built side by side with the school. In the next three, four months, we'll get that standing. That for us is reassuring. So these are some of the take home we are taking back home to we'll reassure the people. And we're also going to prevail on our people to come to the IDP camp in a war. Only the people that are affected, because one of the reasons why we do, the people don't want to come, people want to hijack it. But he has also graciously, you know, listened to our plea that members of Okolo Okwama community be added to the, ID, the committee so that we can be able to identify true Okwama that were affected by the carnage. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.